Okay, Aquarius. Okay, so another channel message for y'all. I got so many different channel messages, y'all. Like this shit is ridiculous. Like this video because you know they've been trying to sell. Can't even talk shadow ban my channel. Okay, so Aquarius. I've been picking up on this for the last two, three weeks, okay? Um, I just finally got to making the actual video because this was like the last straw and I I got that message again. I'm like, fuck it. I gotta do this shit now. So, Aquarius, um, I ain't trying to scare nobody. I ain't trying to do, you know, whatever it is. But there is somebody who is trying to access your personal records and information. But it's having a hard time providing, like, the documentation they need to, or sensitive information they need to, like, leak your shit. Or I'm getting to get the leak or somehow to be the wink, the wink, the weak link. Okay, so... This could be any information, but when I was doing this channel message, I was specifically picking up, like, um, records regarding finances, uh, you know, HIPAA violations, aka, like, health records, um, also, like, passwords to different accounts, as in, like, social media and, um, different things and platforms, but also, I was also picking up on, like, certain information to where, like, um, excuse me, this case incident, so, like, Let's say somebody has like an insurance policy or somebody has something where they're storing their money, like a bank account or something of that sort. Or somewhere where you have your financial institutions or anything like that. Somebody or um, like, you know, if you have a platform like me or like your Instagram or different social media, somebody is literally trying to steal the information that they that you need. But they don't have a picture of this also for some of you guys there could be somebody I, I don't know i just got this down on top of that and also i'm picking up right now that um when i say steal like they don't have the proper information so like if you need your thumbprint or you need your picture or like you need like your passwords or like you know how whenever you get locked out of something they ask you and they're like okay um answer the security questions like the, the, the so people don't have or the information or confirmation codes or like let's say if you locked out of you something they say click here to get back in or like if you locked out of facebook they they send you a confirmation code or they send you a link to get back into your page like it's it motherfuckers is not getting the information like you know how you have your phone number on your account or whatever it is for verification purposes whatever you have going on for verification purposes keep it Whatever you're doing for verification, like I said, four pinnacles and a world card. These motherfuckers just literally trying to come in and steal your information, but it's it's giving the energy of they don't have what they need. So like if somebody's trying to steal your shit, they don't have the answers to security questions. They don't have your face ID. They don't have your fingerprints. They don't have your social security number. Or like they can't prove that they're you. Like also I was picking up somebody could literally be showing up in person to do something. But like there's gonna be somebody like a teller or somebody who's working customer service and they're gonna ask this person like for their ID or how are they related to you or something like that or to call you on the phone or whatever it is. And this person's not gonna be able to do that. They're just gonna be like, oh no, that's fine, you know, um don't worry about it, you know, whatever it is. This is what I've been picking up for the last two to three weeks, okay? Somebody's literally doing this shit, and um, this could be like... I, but I'm not getting, like, a one-time attempt. I'm getting, like, multiple attempts, not only from one person, but different people. Okay, this could be, like, family members, friends, people. I'm getting, like, people who know you, but either you haven't spoken to them in years, you don't fuck with them, or, like, people who just think that they know you more than they think that they do. Yeah. <sighs> that is some crazy-ass shit. So let, let's let's go ahead and look at the situation at hand, Aquarius, because that was the actual channel messages. Let's see who are like who are these individuals who is in, involved in the Aquarius collective's stealing of their um records or you know uh, sensitive information. Okay, um, let's get five cards out of my index. Y'all know me; I just be pulling cards. I got like two different boxes. Okay. So I'm going to go into each card and into detail, but that was literally the channel message. So, you know, just make sure you guys are protecting yourself. Also, there could be like people who are making purchases or try to make purchases with like with your cards or, or you like something like that. Just make sure you're watching your shit. Okay. Um, cause you know, me personally, I just throw my shit down. I'm not even gonna lie. I throw my shit down, throw it in my purse, whatever I do. And that's the end of that. Sorry. I'm just one of those people. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, but bar vibes. So the first card I got is bar vibes. So there's somebody you could recently went to the bar with here or somebody who frequents the bar that you went to recently or that you're going to go to. 
let's see why do we have bar vibes okay for the aquarius what's going on here so strength uh, not strength card um sagittarius energy temperance card this is also the title card so there could be somebody here who um either this is the bartender making the drinks or this is somebody here who's giving you a drink or is offering you to buy you a drink or somehow they're involved in the bar but like the bar scene of some type of way, but they want to see as if they know what they're doing or they're not doing anything. Hermit card. But this person isn't doing this themselves. Like this, There's one person who's like a decoy. There's no, another person in the background who they give all the information to or give the cards to or give your shit away to or like your purse or your ID or whatever it is, the information period. Yeah. These individuals are working together. There's just two individuals. But it's like they're day and night. That's the crazy part about it. Like, there could be, like, a uh, like if you went to a bar or somewhere where they served alcohol or drinks here and you sit at the bar in the booth or however, whatever the fuck you were doing or you went to a club, okay, or some type of lounge, um, there was somebody there who was going to try to steal your information, your identity, your ID, whatever it is, your, um, your bank card, whatever the fuck it was. And this is somebody who either was around the bartender, they could definitely work in cahoots with the bartender, but with the tower card, somehow this was foiled. Somehow that was foiled here. Yeah, King of Cups, because there could have been a water sign, like uh, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or some type of di um, di uh, diligent male, or some type of emotion emotionally mature male. Something fell. I don't know what the fuck that was to fail. But yeah, there was some type of uh, emotionally mature male, ten of pentacles. First, I feel like you could have a lot of money. If somebody who's per somebody who's had a seven of pentacles, one of these individuals were waiting to take your money or waiting to take your finances. Like I said, you could have been, um, you know, lollygagging or talking or doing whatever the fuck you're doing at this bar, this club, whatever it is. And somebody was waiting for you to somehow slip up and somehow they would take your shit yeah but i'm getting with the eight of swords either you kept thinking about this or somehow ten of swords in the in the pisces card specifically yeah somehow you were overthinking this or somehow whoever this pisces cancer or scorpio is have you on the pisces or have you on the water sign or have you on some a, a mature male or some male figure who like um was being like just nice or was watching your back or something like that. There was a male figure here. And I feel like with the Pisces card, the tennis horse, they knew this was going to happen. Or somehow they seen the hints. Maybe you were too fucked up, you were too drunk, or you weren't paying attention, or you were talking to somebody, or whatever you were doing, Aquarius, male or female, um, yeah, eight of swords. Um, eight of swords. I feel like what's going on. You had other things on your mind, or you maybe somehow you were incapacitated, or you weren't at your best mental capacity, or whatever this was. And even if you didn't have a lot of drinks here, I feel like somehow your mind, or I'm getting, you know, it just slipped your mind. But I'm getting, you didn't fall into this trap. <laughs> somehow, some you didn't fall into this trap. Okay. Yeah, I just picked the deck. It's the seven of swords. But the two cards on my phone. We have the strength card and the knight of swords. Somehow. Uh, I don't know, there could have been like a confrontation or somebody talking to you or or looking out for you or pointing something out or whatever the fuck it was and or something like that and that's that's why it didn't happen. Or somehow there was another a situation going on that somehow drew the attention too close to that person, okay? And that's why it didn't happen or I'm hearing the coast got too hot. Yeah, three of cups. Yeah, the coast got too hot or maybe there was like a different celebration or something else going on and that's why it didn't uh work or pan out how this person wanted to yeah six of wands and it ended up being a success for you even though it was supposed to be a success for them yeah let's go to the next card here so we have belly of the beast and we have people pleasing we have i finally um truly realized what i needed but alicia keys aquarius okay alicia keys that's crazy so what's going on here so we have the belly of the beast and people pleasing so what's going on here Ooh. Somebody is trying to steal your information and get you into the belly of the beast, Aquarius. I finally realized what I truly needed. It's like somebody's somebody's purposely like, okay, so people pleasing. I'm gonna go ahead and talk about this because this is exactly what I'm getting here. Somebody who is like a people pleaser, but when it comes to you, so somebody could be like very sweet, very loving, very caring, or like whatever somebody's saying. I don't know. I'm literally hearing like the dolphins from SpongeBob, like. Ah! 
like like you know how on spongebob when they was cussing and shit and he was like hey patrick how the fuck are you but he was like hey patrick how the are you like you know what i'm saying like this is somebody who's trying to like sprinkle sitting in sentence enhancers or like trying to sprinkle some splenda or sugar over whatever bullshit lines are telling you to get you in the belly of the beast or get you like right where they want you okay yeah that's what it is yeah I keep getting this five of pentacles, but no, more importantly, um, with the four of pentacles, hold on, let, let's, let's, let's use a whole different deck because, oh shit, my whole finna, yeah, let's use this deck. So whoever this is, who's like people pleasing you or like trying to be cool with you or trying to like establish some type of camaraderie with you. Yes, yeah, Sun card, this could be somebody who's like a Leo or somebody who wants to seem like they're happy, they're cool, or they have your best interest or, you know, they're just having a good time or they fuck with you. Hierophant card could be a Taurus as well. These are the zodiac signs you need to be watching when it comes to your information who are trying to somehow steal your records or steal like, you know, your cards or steal something regarding to your personal information or time sensitive of um information or something of that sort that i mentioned earlier yes yeah, seven of wands both of these individuals these are people who like to people please you here or like ride your dick okay or ride your pussy if you're a female um <clears throat> judgment card yeah a leo and a Taurus specifically they tried to steal your information before they try to people please you here to steal your like information like whether it's like your card your id um your records your passwords your emails your whatever information that you have like motherfuckers was literally planning to steal this shit or these are motherfuckers who've been trying to set you up to steal your shit steal your personal information or um whatever it is but they don't have the right mix up or they don't have the, the confirmation so like <sighs> seven of wands like motherfuckers really crossed their t's dot their eyes or they really thought that you weren't going to do this like like me personally me for example i'm somebody who like once i use my card i may throw it in my purse but i'm not going to put it directly back in my wallet unless i know for a fact i'm i have time to do that or i want to do that i don't know maybe it's the anxiety in me but um yeah I'm not somebody who does that. So, like I said, for example, you could be somebody who, like, you know, you, you may not cross all your teeth and dot all your eyes because, you you know, you could be, like, somebody, like, for example, Bubsy. What could, what could possibly go wrong? Like, you know, and then something goes wrong. Like, yeah, this is, like, the least of your worries. But these two individuals, yeah, four of cups reverse and the 80 pentacles reverse, I feel like these people, they ain't got no job. They ain't got no money or they don't have as much money as you or they know they don't work a, a nice job than you. I'm getting with the four of cups reverse. These people feel like, you know, um... I wouldn't say it's a hopeless romance or hopeless situation, but they feel hopeless when it comes to their own life. And more importantly, they feel hopeless when it comes to this plan or this scheme or this plot here with the eight of pentacles reversed. Yeah, it's like they're losing money, losing sleep. I'm getting like them riding your dick, them sucking your dick, not like sexually, but like, you know, like if we're talking ego and shit like that and trying to like gas you up and stuff. It's like these people try to do this in the same time Queen of Swords but I'm getting like Queen of Swords, you can see straight through them or like you know the truth or you're protected or something like that here. So like when people are people pleasing you for some type of reason, like I don't know what I'm hearing, that's my eye scream. Like the Spongebob episode, I know I have like a million and one Spongebob re references, but I'm literally seeing the episode when Spongebob is like, that's my eye scream. Like literally, the King of Swords, the verse and the Four of Pentacles, I feel like what's going on, these motherfuckers really thought that, you know... They could hold this close to their chest here or somehow whatever this information that they were trying to steal from you. What they were going to do is they were going to hold it. Yeah, here we go. The page of swords. They were going to hold it so they could somehow stalk you or like create some type of contracts. They were not in your favor. I'm getting to not only help them, but elevate them. Okay, in some type of way. And also with the Queen of Pentacles, the verse to steal like all your money, your finances, your worth. Or like if you have a platform like me, somehow ruin you. Okay, and take everything that you work hard for or whatever this was and give it to them. Okay, hold on, y'all. Sorry, y'all. I'm looking at my damn lashes be sticking together sometimes. Cause I didn't, I didn't use the right glue for my bottom lashes. I just used like regular hair glue. But um, Ace of Swords. That's the clarity. That's the awareness. That's the truth. Like you know, that's just that's just the proof in the pudding. But I feel like Knight of Pentacles, slow and steady, like, and study long, study wrong. Like, this this, this is not going to happen. These motherfuckers are, are trying to move slow as possible to, so like, days, weeks, months. Like, somebody's, this is like a, like, trying to play the long game. But one thing about air signs, we play the long game so well to, like, 
a motherfucker can't play the long game better than us. Like, we didn't already thought about the ending. We didn't already thought about how the movie ends, how whatever, whatever, every possible outcome. But there's somebody here who, likes they're just learning how to play the long game. They're just learning how to play chess. And you're a master at chess, okay? Or you know your surroundings or something like that. But, yeah, Page of Wands is supposed to be, like, bad news for you. But it ended up being bad news for them. Yeah. This is actually really sad. But these are the motherfuckers who are doing this shit. <laughs> yeah. But you just need to watch your information. Like I said, Nine of Cups and Nine of Pentacles reverse. And even if they weren't able to get away with anything, or these different individuals who were able to get away with anything, Nine of Pentacles, Nine of, you know, Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Cups reverse. I feel like motherfuckers thought that they had some type of information and they end up being some bullshit. Like, imagine you're trying to steal somebody's ID and you get a school ID. Or imagine stealing somebody's social security number. It's not even their social security number. It's like um, a f only the last four digits or some type of mix-up of some sort. Like, imagine somebody trying to steal, like, your medical records and they only get, like, um your your vaccination report or like imagine somebody trying to steal your password but like they type the password in and your page is like that password was from two months ago they changed their password already like you you see what i'm saying it's, it's something like that but like i said <clears throat> the only reason why these people want to steal your information with the 38 card and the 12 card because somehow they think this information is power you know i'm hearing high powered cowards the song by gucci man he is an aquarius but what i'm saying here is like you know somehow they think this is supposed to be like a key or get them through like a gate or get them through like some type of doorway or threshold or somehow this like, they whatever your information is they think that there's like some type of truth or wisdom to it or they think that there's some type of um significance to where it's it's going to get them somewhere you know how people say it's not what you know but who you know and this sort of way it's literally what they know not who they know okay yeah 26 this is literally this is literally why they want your information but they think somehow they can use this to their advantage and somehow benefit themselves okay but i just feel like with the with the four card and the, this card here they finna get their ass rag tagged okay or like i said they think they're supposed to get like some type of um foundation or, or marriage or some type of harvest or whatever this is with your information but with the moon card uh this unicorn card and in, in this card with the swans it's just like no matter what you do you, you this, this is not it you, you're taking a gamble you're going to lose every time okay um something could happen on the 17th Okay, also I have the numbers 32, 1, 24, 4, 11, 25, 26, 38, 12. This could be these people's birthdays, like the date of their birthday or the actual month, okay? Okay, but um, yeah, this reading was not too long. I just wanted to go ahead and share this with you guys. But like I said, I'm hearing why the cage bird sings. Like I said, your information is safe, but you need to make sure it is safe or make sure to take extra precautions, okay, guys? Um, But let's, let's get one last in this card before I get up off of here. I just want to... um grab this let's see something could have happened on labor day or labor day was of significance here but i have tour like i said there's a tourist who's doing this specifically <laughs> okay this man's tourist placements it says what's lost will be found also if you lost anything or anything that was lost to you or lost information anything that was lost in the rubble or whatever you lost it will be found okay but yeah you are imperfectly perfect okay and somebody could have been giving you guilty gifts or like i said um these people who, who are people pleasing you they give you guilty gifts or they do things for you out of guilt because they know they couldn't steal your information or they know they couldn't like you know uh, breach things or steal your identity or whatever the fuck it was or they had no success like even if they tried and whatever they thought they had going on it, it, it it's not going to work so there that's what it is okay but this was the reading uh i hope you guys did um love this and resonate with this i will definitely see you all later okay bye